Okay. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Brrr, Ayo, bros. How are you? I just installed the fucking dash cam shiz over here. Okay, okay. I sorted it out over here. So you guys are sorted out. How are you doing, dude? Oh, I'm so fucking sexy as fuck. Okay, let's get it going, man. Let's talk. Let's talk. Let's talk. Type in the chat, yes, if you want to fucking talk. No, I'm kidding. It's not live. It's not fucking live. If you thought it's live, then I fooled you. <laughs> Jokes, dude. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Okay, so let's get to the knowledge. Let's get to the good stuff, bro. Bro, bro. It's your brother Paul. It's your brother Paul. Yo, 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 okay, 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 let's go. I'm riding in my red Ferrari in Tokyo. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm riding in my red Ferrari. Okay. Okay. Uh. Okay, bros. So, today we're going to talk about socializing and shit like that. Some good, good stuff. Okay, so you want to get a big social circle. Now, why do you want to get a social circle, right? Well, obviously so that you can be popular as fuck, right? And so that you can also get girls that lick your abs and lick your nipples and give you hand jobs and tit jobs and stuff like that. So, that's a reason to build a social circle. And also, like, opportunities for what, what job opportunities and blah, blah, blah. I don't do jobs. But I'm with girls that do a lot of jobs. <laughs> Not working jobs, but you know what kind of jobs I'm talking about. I don't accept no jobs, by the way. Okay, so social circle shiz. Here's the one thing, okay? Every person, bro, that you go past, okay? You greet them, okay? You're always greeting people. You're always acknowledging them. And you make friends with people, okay? You meet a hot girl. Make friends with her. Fucking become friends with her, okay? I'm friends with her. Uh, okay. So friend zone her. Friend zone the chicks. Friend zone that ish. Okay. You do that. And uh, friend zone her, nigga. So whenever you go to a certain place, it's gonna be like. <laughs> Let's say you're walking in a KFC, right? So you 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 you've spoken. Opa, speed limit. You've spoken to. The receptionist you kind of know that that person your acquaintances buddies whatever the fuck so let's say the acquaintance's name is felicia and you're like yo felicia how you doing dude yeah call girls dude call them bro whatever the fuck it's it's cool it's it's a cool thing like some people are just not that open-minded to that shit like just be yourself and have fun be your god self god so you'll be like yo felicia how you doing dude and she'll be like oh i'm good dude how are you if your name is mark she'll be like hey mark okay depending on how it is in your country and uh, Peter and I were actually just talking about this last night. So, for example, a lot of people go to the club, so I'll use that example. Oh my goodness, the sun is so in my face. Hey, check the view of the side. <laughs> that view. Oh, shit. Okay. So, you go to the club, you make friends with the, the bouncer or the bodyguard, the security guard at the, the front, bros. You get annoying, but genuinely, not just for fucking social proof, nah, but genuinely, like, as a person, as a human being, okay? So, what helps is if you see him kind of as yourself, in a sense, okay? But you just, like, you're just being, like, you're getting to know him, you're, like, asking him, yo, how you doing, dude? Like, just a simple fucking question like that. People who people don't interact with generally, they appreciate when you speak to them. They'll appreciate it. That stimulation. Someone who's working behind the counter all day, busy <laughs> taking broccoli and going, beep. Beep, beep, cheese, beep, 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 chicken, beep, beep, all that ish. How much action do they get in their day, dude? Fuck, fuck, who speaks to them? Not many people, okay? So, when you say, yo, how are you doing? Be like, oh, wow, I'm doing fine. I'm do then maybe, <laughs> maybe they weren't doing fine, but they're like, I'm doing fine. And maybe they start doing fine now, okay? And you're adding value, so... A great way to make friends is just to add a ton of value while having genuine intentions, okay? So if genuine intentions add that fucking value, 
When I say genuine, when I say genuine intentions, I mean like you're doing it for the right reason. You get what I'm saying? Like you're not doing it to use them. Like fuck that shit. Like how would you like to be treated? Like treat others like that, okay? Okay. And pardon me, I fought it. Oh my goodness. Shh. Don't tell anyone that I fought it. Okay. Don't do that shit. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't give a fuck. I just love life and I love people. The light just went green. Okay. Can you ride with one hand? Okay, no, let's, let's, let's be real. I am being real. I'm always fucking real. Okay. Let's just be honest and shit. As per usual. Okay. So. Hope you can hear me, dude. <laughs> hope you can hear me. So. That's a nice car. There's a, there's a fucking lot of money. There's so much money in the world. Okay. Oh, Paul. <laughs> Flashbacks to last night. <laughs> Kidding. <laughs> I didn't do anything with the girl last night. I didn't allow her to molest me last night. Okay. So, you add that value. You become friends with that person. Power, 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 nigga. You get to know the name. You introduce yourself. Yo, hi, I'm Paul. How are you? And you shake the hand. Hey. And that touch, okay, that helps, okay. That connection. Hey, I'm Paul. Then they now see they, your face now has a name to it. And you are now no longer just a body, you are now a person. <laughs> you were a person before, but now they see you as more of a person and they can connect with you more now that you have a name. It's just a psychological thing. It's how our brains work, okay? And there's reasons for that ish, but we're not gonna dive there right now. We're gonna focus here. So you give them your name, not everybody, but certain people that you feel it's right to do so. Okay? And you walk past people like, hey, ma'am, how are you doing? I'm doing well. And you walk past. You just like, you keep walking, turn your head as you're walking. Yeah, how are you doing? Oh, great, great. Just don't walk. Don't walk into a pole. Okay, don't be careful. Of don't walk into a pole. <laughs> okay. And uh, oh, I'm loving life so fucking much. Uh, so much. I love life. And you be open with them. You be open as fuck. There's a video by Jason Capital called What to Say. And I refer a lot of people to that video. That helps a lot. It helped me. Especially especially when, when I was wondering, like, yo, what, what do you say to girls? Okay, right? How do you fucking communicate? And the thing is, we already have that ish inside of us. When you're being a god self, you're going to be doing that ish automatically. Okay. Because of conditioning and social conditioning and media and all that stuff, and news and propaganda and all that stuff, a lot of us still have to tap back into being your God self, okay? And it's good to have that reminder of how this stuff works, okay? How to be your God self, to be your genuine real self, okay? Oh, I love my hair and my eyes. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> so when you're walking through the shop now through the club, okay, people are now gonna see, oh wow, you walking through, right? You're greeting the bartender, hey, what's up Frank? And he's like, hey, what's up Mark? And then you walk and then there's a the person there who, who, who serves a waitress or waiter and you're like yo what's up what's up uh donovan it's like yo mark how are you doing man and he's excited to see you right because you add so much value to him and you guys are like broskies right because his wins are your wins and your wins are his wins so you have that perspective and it becomes like that so you're a team you're broskies right so you he feels cool now he's like yay someone greeted me i'm noticed someone remembered my fucking name and then they're like, yo, they return the favor in a sense. They're like, yo, bro, yay. And they're happy to do so, okay? It's awesome. You guys are connecting. You broskies, real genuine broskies, okay? That's the mindset, man. And that love, okay? That love. By the way, here's something. NLP anchoring. <laughs> if you want to, if you want someone to, if you want to help someone associate a certain emotion or feeling with you, you say something and at the same time you point at yourself or you point to wherever you want the association to go. So generally you do it subtly or you do it in the moment. So it's like, I'm like, what did I say? Genuine 
broski or something like that. It's like genuine broski. You get what I'm saying? So you want to be a genuine broski, okay? I am genuine. Why else would I help you, bros? For free and fucking do all this awesome fucking stuff, okay? Uh, I'm not even gonna try and convince. Like, bros, here's another thing. Don't try and persuade people. Like, yeah, sure, it's fine for, to help them, to benefit them. But, like, don't try and prove yourself. Don't fucking do that. Because the moment you try to prove yourself, you put um, your power in their control. So don't fucking try to prove yourself. Like, now, I'm not gonna try and prove that I'm genuine. I know I'm fucking genuine. I got a fucking tattooed on my fucking chest for myself, okay? So, don't try and prove yourself. Especially, like, with chicks, too. Don't try and fucking prove yourself, okay? Just be you. Have your goals, make the world a better place, save people, and those that want to be helped, help those niggas, okay? Add value wherever you can, okay? Just like you're adding value in the shop, you're greeting this guy, greeting that guy. And what happens is you develop a massive amount of social proof. So people are like, oh, this guy, Mark, which is you in the example, I don't know what your name is, but you're watching, but <laughs> maybe I do know you, but obviously I'm talking to a camera. You know what I mean, right? So, <laughs> so. They're like, wow, Mark is the social proof. And when you're doing that, you're already making first impressions. Like, you don't need to greet people to make first impressions. You walk past them, you enter their field of view, you've made a first impression. You, they hear about you, that's a first impression. She tastes your abs or your cock, that's a first impression. I'm playing, obviously, I'm playing around. But yeah, yeah, she tastes your cock, that's a first impression, that chick, whatever chick it is. Bless her. Okay. I'm gonna let my future wives suck my cock. I'm not gonna like just let any girl suck my cock. Now fuck that. Okay, this is a glorious cock. So, you have that social proof. They're like, the girls are like, oh wow, Mark is so popular in their subconscious mind. And the thing is, you are popular. You got broskies. There's value there, okay? You're doing that, you're doing that. You're building it up wherever you go. You got like your own home base and shit like that, okay? So, bros, hope that helps you, okay? And your friends own all the girls, cause when girls see you with other chicks, that adds to your social proof. Subconsciously, instinctively, they're just like, oh god, they got this gut feeling like, why are these girls all around this guy? What is it that he has? What is it that he has? Okay, they see, what do they see in him? And that draws them towards you. That draws them towards you. So. Take action, implement that ish, greet people, introduce yourself, just say hi, hey, hey, hi, in a nice way. Hi, like this, this is super nice. Hi, hey, hey, you, awesome jacket, bro. Awesome fucking jacket. Why are you so cool? Okay. <laughs> I know I got an awesome jacket. Bros, I love you. Take action, get results, simple as fucking that. And if you're awesome, subscribe, bro. Whoa. Oh.